Oh, oh, so it's just a hand grenade launcher. Interesting. I could wield it. It's got 15 shots. <laughs> I would have to make sure that I connected with it. I don't know. I'll hold on to it. Eagle! Okay. Speared Star. Using a heavily armored AC, his presence can be felt from a long distance. Alright, so he's got the same pulse rifle. He's got the two missiles. And then, I don't know what other back weapon he has, if any. I mean, I'll just sit on the other side of this building and fire stuff into the sky. Ooh, I think all of those missiles just connected. Yeah, look at his health. Ow, 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 ow. Okay. Alright, that's half my missiles. This is why you don't use these missiles on missions, because they're... I mean, what are the odds that you're actually going to connect with something? But here, in the arena, where it doesn't matter, you can just fire things off. Alright. You know, just don't engage. Fire off 80 vertical missiles, and then when you feel like you have the upper hand, jump in and hope that you don't get <laughs> bitch slapped <laughs> too hard. Oh, he had a slug gun. Okay. And that is not viewable in his, his profile picture, which is weird. This giant gun on his back that you just can't see. Let me go back to that. Let me look at that real quick. Where's the where's the giant fuck off gun? I guess it's like this small, like right behind his head. There's like a little block of green, and I think that's the slug gun that's like vertically going into the sky. It's a it's a deceptive angle. <laughs> Firecrest, glorious. Okay. Mines and missiles. Not great at short-range combat. He prefers to use rockets and missiles. Oh, th those are... Yeah, that's a large missile. It's got a barrel on the top of it. I thought it was one of those mine blocks. <laughs> My bad. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Ow. Yeah, okay, okay.
Man, this fight. Hopefully one more big barrage. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Yeah, I started trying to... He, well, he eventually got on the ground and stopped flying. He stopped going up and back down. He was just scooting around and getting kind of caught in between buildings. Um, but finally, near the end of that, I was like, wait, I need to keep him locked on. And then, as he's going back down, I need to fire stuff up so that by the time it arcs up and comes back down, he's landing and getting that shock from landing his legs buckling and then those things can hit sundown spider uh and i don't know what that is but it has an umlaut considered to be an average pilot he controls his flashy ac with confidence what does he got slug gun pillbox like quad rifle and then vertical indirect missiles okay Yeah. <clears throat> Is he going to take to the skies? Get away from me. <laughs> Oh, that's a laser gun. I thought it was a slug gun on his back. It's a laser rifle. There we go. Yeah, I was able to hit him with a lot of missile barrages, so that wasn't so bad. He has a uh, plasma cannon. It's a big plasma cannon on his back. <laughs> yeah, that, that would have hurt getting hit with one of those. Eliminator. Swordsman. Eliminating his enemies with a sword is what he does best. So he has... Oh, he's going to be close range. So he has a rocket, he has a chain gun, he has a handgun. So yeah, he wants to get in close. <clears throat> the chain gun's going to make him sit down with a humanoid legs. But with a handgun, he's going to he's going to try and play a, a close game. The handgun is going to have the stagger effect, which is super fun. Yeah, he's sitting there with that chain gun. So he's going to he's going to eat all these missiles.
Yeah, he's just gonna... <laughs> that didn't hit anything, but it caused a lot of damage. Keep him locked on. And just try and guess when he's gonna land. That was great. That was about a thousand damage right there. That was early. Nope, he landed. Keep this lock on, hold it. Now. There, he's got his chain gun going. Yeah, he just kind of sat there. He tried to use that chain gun and I just punished him for it. <laughs> And there were a few times I was able to lead pretty well where um, he was going up and coming back down and I was able to hit him with the... Hit him with the rockets. Or the, the vertical missiles. Time it well. All right. Bruiser and Charger. The Bruiser, as he is known, uh, is very aggressive and prefers to attack his victims from the front. So he's got chain guns, he's got a big rocket launcher, and I don't know if he has another back weapon. Oh, it's not chain guns, it's lasers. Ow, ow, ow. Well, he just used up a lot of energy right there, so that's good to know. Yeah, those laser guns hurt a lot. But they also use up a lot of his energy. Oh my gosh, yeah, he's taking a pounding. I think he just took all four missiles right there. Oh my gosh, I had a full lock on and then just turned weird. Where are you? There you are. He's also white, so he's blending in with the snow a little bit. Six health, come on. There we go. Yeah, those <laughs> that twin laser cannon hurts, but he, he went up into the sky and just went zhuz, 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 and I got hit a couple of times, but then he was just probably out of energy. I assume. Maybe not. What was he what did he have? Large rocket. Oh, and a linear gun. Yeah, he went up in then he was out. He's done. I mean he has the same thing that I do. Yeah, that linear gun was... Oh, That sucked right there. That hurt. <clears throat> We're number 20. He's separating himself from the average pilot, but the competition is tough from here on. I believe it. Alright, let's go save. Just to make sure. Boop, 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 boop. Burn. Flamer! Pilot of an ominous looking AC. Really? That's ominous looking? He looks like the Joker. <laughs> <laughs> like the the logo that he has is ominous and badass, but then you look at that and you're like, or he looks like, he looks like a Mardi Gras, like a king cake. 
Uh, he has a well-balanced machine at his command. He's got the laser guns. He's got large missiles. And I don't know what that last thing is. Large missile. If I get hit one of those, it's going to suck. I think they have 12 shots in them. But they they their attack power is crazy. It's like three or 4,000. I'm not going to take three or 4,000 because, of course, I have, like, defenses and things like that. But it's going to hurt if I get hit with one of those big rocket, big missiles. Like that. Oh, my God. Well, I'm at half health. Ow. Yeah. Yep, one, I mean, that's the thing is, when your primary weapon is a, is a laser anything, if you don't have something that you can resort to in the meantime, it you can't be mobile and dangerous. <laughs> so, like, you know, just like the last guy, he bounced up in the air and fired off, like, I took a lot of damage right here. I took a large missile and immediately took some plasma cannons. Like that right there. Then he flew all the way to the sky, ran out of energy. I mean, I took... I took like 3,400 damage, like out the gate. Because the big missile connected and did damage, and it also staggered me, which means that he was able to land those, those laser shots. Staggering in this game is pretty important. Sadistic Scorpion version 1.0. Uh, low man on the Scorpion team. Oh, there's a Scorpion team? Uh, his ability is more than average within the arena. So he's got a bazooka. He's got, I think that's a multi-missile pod. And I have no clue what that thing is on the back. That may be that, may be that long laser cannon that we saw earlier that I thought was a slug gun. But it's a, I think it's a, one of the deep laser cannons. Man, this dude can just fly forever. All right, well, I fucked up by thinking I could outfly him. Oh my god, I'm getting staggered. Yeah, you see that? Staggering? Get out of there. I can't, I literally can't move. So yeah, those bazookas were hitting me and, and staggering my AC. And I, I could not get out of that loop. I got stun locked, essentially. Oh, he's got a sword. He's got one of the beam swords. Ooh, 
Ooh, he hit me with it. All right. He hit me with that beam. Okay, interesting. Uh, yeah, we're gonna continue. We're gonna we're gonna fight again. Um, yeah, he hit me with that beam, sword beam, and it did like <laughs> like fifteen hundred damage. But really, the big damage was getting staggered by that uh baz bazooka barrage. I gotta make sure not to have that happen to me. Oh, get up, get up, get up. Oh, what? Oh, my God. I'm stuck in a building. <laughs> oh, get out of that loop. get away Oh, that was a good salvo right there that did some damage. Oh god. Oh, the fucking bazookas. Ow, ow, ow. Stop it. There's a sword. I landed. That's the thing. I landed. I'm like, oh, okay. I, I may need to change out my build for this dude because he's flying around so much that the vertical missiles aren't aren't making contact. So I need to get something else. Let me let me do this. So first things first. Um, these things are gonna just get unequipped um i think we're gonna go back to the what is the so the range is there i may want to do this How much does this thing weigh? Can I buy another one? 330. No, I can't. Ugh. Ah. 
Well, what's the weight difference here? I think this is a pretty light... Yeah, it's still a pretty lightweight gun. Oh my gosh. We'll just go back to our... Yeah, we'll just go back to our standard. And see if just having a little bit of mobility will help. You just gotta change change things up sometime. Because you eventually hit a, a pilot, like either the AC or the pilot itself, that you just can't deal with and you have to think about it in a different way. Man, I'm not used to being this fast now. So we just gotta survive. And be really accurate with our machine gun. And not get stuck in buildings. And let him uh, burn through his bazooka ammo without taking too much damage. <coughs> Ooh, God. Just let him be aggressive. Oh my god, I took all of that. <laughs> Just let him be aggressive and waste his ammo. I have no clue where this dude is. Oh, there he is. Ow. Man, he's landing those hits. <laughs> Man, he's landing those shots. Okay, hmm. I'm gonna try again with this. This is the first this is our first loss and we've we've hit a, a brick wall with this dude. I just wonder what else we can try. I don't know where this dude wound up. There he is. And, and some of you may be thinking like, hey, why don't you switch to a bazooka? The problem is the bazooka has a very small window to, of lock-on. Yeah, this guy's got a lot of damage output. 
Yeah, I forgot he still has those fucking warheads. Yeah, so like, he still has. <laughs> so we've lost to this guy four times. Um, so what is he? He has he has a bazooka. He has, he just, he's just relentless as well. So we need something to either like burst him down. That's the problem. He just, he's good at, he's good at all ranges. He has the multi-missile warhead. So that's good long range. He has the laser cannon, which he eventually, like, shifts to. That bazooka just does... I mean, it's just so much damage. I mean, I'm tempted to maybe just, like, buy the heavy machine gun and just, like, lay into him. I want to test out some of these different FCSs. This is one thing I really haven't tinkered with. Do I have the weight for this? I do. Fucking narrow and deep. We'll try this. Um, this may, honestly, it may be such a small lock-on that I won't be able to do anything with this to keep people in in my lock-on. Main system. We'll see. Engaging test oh, fuck no. Yeah, this can't even lock on that that far away <laughs> so fuck that yeah we're not gonna do that um so i didn't like that one this was like wide and shallow this was also narrow and deep Let's try this. And it may be that the gun itself just doesn't lock on very, very far away. You know? It may be a limitation of the gun Main itself. System. Engaging test mode. Uh, wait. I'm so confused. Does this gun have a narrow and deep lock on? <laughs> <laughs> Did I actually change the FCS? Hold on a second. I did. Wait, does this gun have a narrow and deep lock on? Wide and shallow. Special. We can try that. Let's see what that does. Does that change anything as far as the lock-on? I need something larger than that. Main system. Engaging test mode. I mean, this is a little better. Where's this other guy go? Behind me.
Target demolished. Halting. I don't know how I feel about this. Usually this this doesn't have this kind of lock on. It usually has like a standard lock on. It locks on like it it has a standard lock on. try this and see if it gives me that wider lock on that I've seen some of the other people have let's see if this changes my lock on if this doesn't work then I'm just gonna go back to my normal machine gun stuff but yeah what a brick wall we've hit <laughs> I'm just trying to figure something else out Main system engaging test there we go this is better other guy go there he is yeah it may just be that i have to like Target demolished. get a beat on this Halting dude test mode and then just light him up we'll try this we'll try it out <clears throat> Or it may just be like, hey, why don't you go to a different arena? Maybe that is what I need. <clears throat> Fight him in a place where he can't fly up. <laughs> I've lost track of them. I'm trying to lock onto him now. I'm trying to scan him with my missiles. There we are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You hit me with your bazookas. Man, I don't think there was a single bullet that connected right there. Stop it. If my guy could stop getting staggered, that'd be awesome. Ow, ow, ow. I mean, it's just constant. It's just constant bazookas. Like, that's all he's hit me with so far has been bazookas.
Like I, I didn't get a, I didn't get a bead on him. Maybe I just need to like run and survive the bazookas. Let him run out of bazookas. Because after he runs out of bazookas, he stops flying around as much. So maybe I just need to let him do his thing and just let him run out of bazooka shots. Just run and live. <clears throat> just let him use up all his ammo or something. I mean, that's maybe maybe what that's what it is is just surviving until he runs out of bazookas. Which is hard to do when he's got a like an angle of attack that is above me. Oh, there it is. Yep. Land and take like 300 damage. Ow, ow, ow. Just landed a few shots in a row right there. That is not great. Ow. Okay. <laughs> Quit getting staggered. Just land. He still has so much more ammo. He still has so much more damage to dish out. It's like my bullets don't hit. I mean, look at that. Like, nothing hit. Yeah, it's like these bullets are really easy to dodge or something. Good. Okay, we gotta think of something else. What is up? So, we gotta survive the Bazooka Onslaught. Here, I'm, I'm I actually... Oh, I wanted to watch the replay. Yeah, I wanted to leave, though. Man, what a fucking brick wall this is. This is rough. How are we gonna survive this? What are we gonna do? I wonder if we can just make, like, a missile boy that just, like, unloads shit.
Wait. 15, 60. And then what were these doing down here? Mm. They weigh they weigh a lot though. They weigh more than two of these things combined. We're gonna try and just like missile barrage this dude. And see if that'll do something. <laughs> Cause I don't I don't know what else to do. Just barely. Look at this. All right. Nothing but missiles. Fucking hell. Let's try it. We're just going to fire off a shit ton of missiles at this dude. Man, I was not expecting to hit a brick wall this soon. At, at 18? I was expecting maybe like top 10 to be tough, but this guy is... Oh, just r rough to deal with. We start off with no defense as well. Because we don't have a uh, Arms that have armor. So far, his missiles have hit me and none of mine have hit him. It's pretty great. It's the duality of missiles, right? Ow, ow, ow. Oh yeah, remember how he also has a bazooka and that was like everything we feared earlier? I don't know how to deal with this dude. <laughs> how do you... Hmm. Because he just has an insane amount of damage and longevity... I'm just trying to think of ways to, like, burst them down, you know? Maybe let's use... Like, we start with no uh, health. Can't, can't sit still like that. Can't get staggered. So that missile pack is done. Maybe I need to go back. I don't think I've fought this dude with the vertical missiles yet. Maybe I needed to go back to that.
Or maybe I just need like a big boy that can, can take some uh, bazooka hits and not be broken apart. Ow, yep. Stagger City. Alright, that's all our big missiles, so now we just have these small missiles that are not going to connect with anything. Where was he? Done some good damage. There he is. More bazookas. me with one laser from downtown oh my god this is rough I did a lot of damage that's the thing is I did more damage this time around than I've done before I got him down to 2,000 <sighs> maybe I need to go I don't think I fought him with the um, vertical missile the missile base did I keep all that stuff or did I sell it Try it out. <laughs> I mean, this is awful. And he's like the low man on the totem pole for like the scorpion crew. God, I was blitzing through these things. I went through like, what, 12 of them? Like back to back, no stopping. I've now lost this guy like eight times. Yeah, those missiles aren't going to do anything until he sits still. Oh my gosh! That did half of my health. I want to. I want to watch that again. I want to. I want to see this replay. He has 80 shots. So I'm at 8,000 health. Boom. That was 3,800 damage with that sword. That's bullshit. <laughs> so it has 80 bazooka shots. And that's the thing. That is the lightweight bazooka. There's another one that does more damage per shot that has 50 shots. It's 80 fucking shots. And he's landing them all.
I've been spotted. Here it comes. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, yep, landed. Maybe I just need maybe I just need a fat dude to survive all of this. Maybe I need to make like the biggest boy I can. Get up. Where'd he go? I've literally lost this lost him in the snow. Die, die, die. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Finally! Holy shit! With 132 health left, and I ran out of energy midair. Oh my god. I thought I was gonna finish this tonight. Maybe, maybe I'll keep going. Maybe this is like a brick wall that a lot of people hit. I did it though. Oh, that sucked. <laughs> that was awful.